Staromest's name is D. M. Prague, Czech Republic. Old Town Square, in Czech known as Staromest's name is D is the central square of the historic part of Prague. The square is one of the greatest tourist attractions of the Czech capital, along with Charles Bridge and Prague Castle. It is almost impossible to miss it if you're coming to Prague as a tourist. Old Town Square is an historic square inch is the Old Town Quarter of Prague, the capital of the Czech Republic. It is located between Wenceslas Square and Charles Bridge. The most significant square of historical Prague, it was founded in the 12th century and has been witness to many historical events. In addition to the old town hall and the Church of Our Lady before 10, the square is dominated by the Baroque Church of St. Nicholas, the Rococo Kinski Palace, the Gothic House at the Stone Bell and the Monument to Jan Haas. In the pavement of the square are memorial stones marking the execution of 27 Czech lords in 1621, and the Prague Meridian. Attractions and Sightseeing at the Old Town Square Astronomical Clock Prague's Old Town Astronomical Clock, the world-famous technical miracle from the 15th century, definitely belongs among the biggest must-see attractions not only in Prague, but perhaps the whole of Europe. Every year for over six centuries, hundreds of thousands of tourists from all over the world visit the clock and patiently wait in the Old Town Square for its show to start. Old Town Hall The Old Town Hall belongs among the most noteworthy monuments of Prague, not least because of its above-mentioned astronomical clock. The hall was founded as the first of its kind in the country in 1338, based on a privilege vested by John the Blind, the Count of Luxembourg and King of Bohemia, to the townsmen. The oldest part of the complex, built in the Gothic style, consists of a beautiful tower with the astronomical clock. The eastern neo-Gothic wing of the old town hall was destroyed during the Prague Uprising in 1945. Visitors can see historical halls, the tower, and the underground premises. The old town hall is also a very popular venue for weddings. Churches The Gothic Church of Our Lady before 10 is one of Prague's dominant viewpoints. It took almost 200 years to be built. The church amazes with its beautiful, 80-meter-high towers and a rich Baroque interior. Nowadays, the cathedral serves as a gallery. The Baroque Saint Nicholas Church was built between 1732 and 1737, in place of a Gothic church which burnt down. The remains of the former church can be found in the basement. The Saint Nicholas Church attracts with its main marble altar, beautiful sculptural decoration of the access front, and the stucco decor created by Bernardo Spinetti. Other historical buildings Kinski Palace is a significant historical Rococo building on the eastern side of the old town square. It was built in the 18th century and nowadays still amazes with its rich interior decoration and two monumental gates with pillars. The National Gallery placed some of its valuable collectibles in the palace's premises. Right next to the Kinski Palace, one can find the house at the Stone Bell. The house is nowadays just the residue of the original building from the 14th century. The Prague Gallery organizes various cultural events in the originally Gothic building, later reconstructed in the Baroque style to with the facade quite recently renewed in the original Gothic style. Yet another precious historical site of Prague can be found close to the Old Town Square. The history of Ungelt reaches back to the 12th century. Even though each house in the complex represents a different architectural style, the resulting general appearance is harmonic and also absolutely unique. In the center of the Old Town Square, the Janus Memorial dominates, reminding all Prague residents and visitors of one of the most significant and world-renowned Czech historical figures. The memorial represents Jan Haas, a religious reformer, who was burned for his unshakable beliefs at the stake in Constance in 1415. The Secession Bronze Memorial was dedicated in 1915, on the 500-year anniversary of Master Jan Hus martyrdom. The statue was created by a prominent Czech sculptor called Ladislav Salon and is protected as a national cultural heritage. Janus is displayed in the middle of other figures, proudly looking towards the Church of Our Lady before 10, which used to be the center of the Calixtins in his era. 
Like us and join us at Extreme Collections for more fun and knowledge.